Hello, hi, I'm coming to you with a new puppy haul of everything I got from my new pup. If you would like to know anything about this massive and very detailed puppy haul that I purchased for my puppy, continue watching. Hi YouTube, my name is Karen and I'm here today to film my puppy haul. Um, this is my first time doing a YouTube video of any sort so bear with me <laughs> but i'm here today to show you everything that i got for my new puppy my puppy is a yorkshire terrier um aka or yorkie and i wanted to pick up uh a dog that fits my life fit my lifestyle because i have four kids they're hypergetic so you know i don't know what my kids are used to because they're never um around dogs i'm a first time dog owner so that's perfect for me less shedding for me because due to my kids so i needed a breed that can fit my everyday lifestyle um yorkshire terriers doesn't need that much of exercise 15 to 20 minutes is would be great for a yorkshire terrier if you're interested in one um that's why i choose that breed because many people ask me well why that breed i know a lot of people saying that about um why you want to go to the shelter, dog shelters. I mean, I tried to, and they, they didn't have that particular breed that I was looking for. And I was really into that breed due to the fact of my kids. So, um, I'm a new dog, I'm a new dog owner, never owned anything. So that's why I'm a little bit excited. Well, I'm overly excited. Um, yeah, that's why I think I went over and beyond for this puppy because me and my kids are very excited. Um, I will try to link pictures at the end of the video because, like I said, this is my first time doing a YouTube video. So, I'm going to try to edit as much as I can for you guys. So, enough talking and let's get into the video. Now, I'm going to do the big items first to put it out of the way. So, with that being said, <laughs> this is the puppy food that my breeder recommended that I get for her, being that she's um, on this one. And she's a girl, by the way. She's seven weeks. I'm going to go pick her up next Saturday. <laughs> so she's seven weeks. I will get her at eight weeks. So within a week, um, I'm going to go pick her up. So this is the Pure Balance 11 pound dog food. Yeah, so this is grain-free, natural ingredients with vitamins, minerals. Um, number one ingredient is raised, um, um, farm-raised chicken. No wheat, corn, soy, or ingredients, and no filters, artificials, and preservatives, or any other of that sort. Yeah, so this is that. Her food, you know, all dogs eat food. Up next, I got her a food container to store her food in to keep it nice and fresh for her. Up next, I got her a large dog mat just to put her food on. So I bought her, I think this was on Amazon for $6. It's a large food mat. Yeah. So, and the, the food container was at Walmart for $9. As, by the way. Because she's going to be so small, she's the smallest out of her litter. She has two boys. She In her litter, it was two boys and one girl. She was the smallest. So, my breeder said she would be no more than five pounds. Which is perfect for, for me and my kids. Because I didn't want big dogs. And I stay in an apartment. So, you know, a large dog would be too much for me right at the moment. So... I did, she did recommend these bowls, little bowls, because she's so small. Yeah, they are from, they're just from Dollar Tree from, for like a dollar each. They have the puppy print paws on the side of them, if you can see it. Yeah, so because she's going to be so small, I will pick up some other ones later on but it's non-slid on the bottom 
So I will pick up some other ones. But for right now, this is going to be perfect for her. As my breeder recommended because she's very small. So I picked up that for her. Now, I did get puppy pads. Puppy training pads. I will be training her to use the potty indoors and out. I got this from Amazon for $19.99 for $120. $120. So I got this big bad boy on Amazon. Now, I got a pee pee holder to hold her, her puppy pads in. Next, I got a 36. 36 um, inch dog crate that I got is one door and this dog crate is from Chewy. Fresco's Better Goods is from Chewy. I got her dog crate just because I'm gonna um, crate train her. Ooh. Whoa, technical difficulties. I'm back. Sorry. Just because I'm going to crate train her. So I got her that. Next, I got her two disposable pop-up lids. Let me just take out one for you guys to see. I got her that on Amazon. And by the way, her crate was $32 on Chewy. Chewy is going to be my best friend because they're inexpensive. So yeah, this is a pop-up reusable bowl in this color as well and you they have this latch thing that you could just have just something portable to go out i mean if you're in places and you need it i mean you can put it in her anything like with anything that you want with your dog you can always have these you know it was four dollars on amazon so you cannot beat it i mean i decided to get these for her Next is her bed, her crate bed. Like I said, she's going to be small. So I decided to get this crate bed. It's soft on the inside. And I bought this from Dollar General for $8. I bought this for Dollar General. Like I said, she's going to be a small breed when I get her. So I'm going to put this in her crate. Okay. The next thing that I got her is a pet kennel. This kennel cab is from Petmate. Um, it's up to for 10, 10 pounds. It's up to 10 pounds for a cat, dog, whatever. Um, like I said, she's going to be um, 5 pounds. So I decided to get her a, a carrier. So when I took her to the vet, anywhere I need to take her, I bought this for her. So I can just... Um, so I can just take her to places. That's what I bought. I bought her a playpen. It's a pop-up playpen on Amazon. And um, no, I bought this from Chewy. It was nothing but $25 on Chewy. It's a portable pet playpen. 48 for um by 48 by 25 inches it's durable and it's comes this is a toe it's from paw pals just for them i bought her this on chewy as well it's just a playpen for when i'm not around or when i'm sorry so when I'm not around and um, I can just put her playpen on, I'm doing um, yard work or any other things, um, cooking, and I won't be able to watch her. So I bought this for her just so she can play in and, you know, besides being in her crate all day, she could be in her playpen. So that's that. My breeder did recommend this. She recommended that dogs need water all day. You know to provide fresh water for her so i did decide to hook to try to hook this to her crate so she can always have water fresh water 
because she did say that um Yorkshire Terry's Yorkies love to drink water. So I decided to like um put this um hook it onto her crate. Hook it and um this was on Amazon for eleven dollars. The pet carrier was twenty three. If I'm not mistaken, this is um on Amazon for eleven dollars. So I decided to get this for her because my um breeder recommended it. And um it's something that is leak is leak proof. Um it's called it's from Sun Grow No Drip Pet Water Bottle. So I decided to get this for her. Okay, on to the next. This is a leash that I've decided to get for her. I will take it out of the package. This is what it looks like. It is 16 foot inch long. Being that she's not going to be a big breed. But what I like about this, for 10 to 11 bucks, it has a light. Sorry. It has a light. And, um, yeah, I think that that will be very come in handy. Even I'm not going to walk her at night. But um, if it was, like, to be a little dark and um, we're outside still, I can use that. So this will come in handy for me. Okay. Cleaning supplies. Well, her grooming. This is um, a microfiber towels. It's tin. And um, my breeder said that microfiber towels are really good for when she's taking a shower and she comes from, you know, taking a shower. Microfiber towels remove grease, stains, whatever it is. So I did purchase this for $4 at Walmart. So I purchased this for her. It's 10 of them that comes in, microfiber towels. So I decided to purchase this for her. I purchased this from Chewy. It's a de deodorizing spray, cologne spray. It's from Fresh and Clean, cologne spray. And this is the 12 ounce, 12 ounce and it's long lasting scent, help, helps keep pets smelling fresh and clean. I did read good reviews on this. Um, they said it lasts a long time, so I decided to get this. It's 12 ounce, I mean, and this was on Chewy for, I can about say $8. So I decided to get this because I know that dogs go outside, they get smelly, and between washes and her bath, I can be able to use this so she can smell good and fresh, and we don't have to worry about that. Even if she doesn't take a shower, I mean, if she doesn't smell fresh, this is the solution. So yeah, I decided to get that. With her shampoo and conditioner, I decided to go with this. This is the Burks and Bees Oatmeal Conditioner for dogs. I got this also on Chewy. Yeah, so it's the 10 ounce Burks and Bees Oatmeal Conditioner and Honey for dogs. And this is with pH balance pH balance for dogs, cruelty free, without sulfates, fragrance, or colorants. So, I read this also, and they had good reviews on Chewy as well. So, I got this from Amazon. It is the Fresh and Clean Shampoo and Conditioner. It's No, it's Scented Shampoo. I'm sorry. So it is called Classic Fresh and Shampoo, Scented Shampoo, number one. And it locks in moisture while leaving a soft, clean, manageable coat for your pet. Number one groomer preferred. So I bought this, and this is 18 ounce. So this will probably last quite a bit for my dog. And um, before I buy anything for her, I usually um, do reviews. Look at the reviews to see if everything is good and okay and copacetic. Now, uh, what else? anything else in here? Okay, I decided to. I was gonna go buy blankets, but um, it's this friend. She um was giving away her blankets. She said that it was only one time use, so I did wash them of course. So I did get this blanket for her. 
for my dog. It's like a pink baby blanket for her. It's a long pink blank baby blanket. And when I go pick her up next Saturday, I'm going to rub her mother's sink. Even though the breeder said that she gives um blankets and everything for the dog. But I decided to, you know, keep this in handy for when I go there. I can just keep it with her scent. So her transitioning her first night would be smooth. I also would like to put this in her crate. It's just yellow and white. Nice color for her crate. It's very long. I'm going to, you know, use these two for her to put in her crate. Now, on to treats. I did got these two bowls. I thought it was look it looks great. It has dog it have um paws and bones on it. So I got this from Dollar Gen Dollar Tree and it was just a dollar each. I thought it was like really cute and neat. To put her treats in. Um, yeah, I really thought that, you know, it, it will come in handy for her treats that I am going to be feeding her, obviously. And this is a Kong. So I got, like, um, I've been watching um, a lot of puppy hauls. And this is a famous tour for a dog or puppy. And I've learned that they come in all levels. All sizes so I guess whenever the puppy's older you get a the older it gets the bigger it gets so I heard that you can put treats in this and um everything and um peanut butter treats you can put fruits in it for the dog so I decided to get this and I think that it's like very distractive for the dog whenever you know you're away from your puppy um this it would help tons Um, okay. Defective spray. I got for cleaning. This is cleaning supplies. It's new, obviously, from Dollar General. It's from my pet's friend. So I bought two of these, of course. It's a pet stain odor and urine mover. Um, compared to... Compared to performance of your urine gone, it's got strong enzyme power. And I heard that, you know, you don't want something to have a strong scent. Um, Non-toxic formula, powerful odor extractor. So this is very good for the dog, um, for, you know, cleaning the dog um, mess. So I got these for her. So I also have this other cologne that I got from Walmart. And it was $2.97. And I also see it was good reviews on this as well. So it is a six ounce. Um, it's fresh and um spray. Um, the scent is raspberry. In between bath spray helps keep the dogs fresh, smelling snugly. So I also decided to get this for my dog. You know, she she can never, you know, not go without. So I did have this. This is a two-sided brush which is from dollar tree as well and um you will want this for you know combing and brushing your dog daily but with yorkies you just brush them um every day even though they, they do not shed but you brush them every day and it'll keep their coat nice and clean so yeah i decided to get this two-sided brush for her i decided to get this steel comb the comb which was from Walmart and it was for three dollars it's from it's for medium to long coats you can just brush you know your dog with it you know I also got this for my dog this is a oxy fast stain remover best for stains it's called out yeah, so this is a 32 ounce. It works great for tough stains, oxy cleaning power. Breaks down the stain from the surface. So what's good about this product is it's child friendly. So I would be using this a lot because it's good for both my pet and my my kids. So I would be using this um a lot and I got this for 375. 
at Walmart. Now, on to her toys. I got this rope toy, actually two rope toys I've gotten for her. They were at, from Dollar Tree for a dollar, and I thought it was cute, so I got it for her. I got these um, plush toys that I've gotten for her, also from Dollar Tree. This is another dog toy that I got. I think this is a um, look like a I don't know what is it, but I know it's like a dog toy. <laughs> so it comes along and has a squeaker to it. So I bought those for her. This, this, this. And this comes in fours. And I bought this from Dollar General for four dollars. I guess a dollar each toy. And this is just a squeaker, a rub toy. This squeaks as well. I can't find a squeak. There we go. It squeaks as well. Look how cute is that. And a ball. I also purchased that for her. These are another squeaker toy that I bought from Dollar Tree. This is the squeaker toy. And they have spikes. Um, puppies do tend to um be teething, so it has like little spike textures on it. And I bought this for three dollars at Dollar General. <laughs> yeah, so um I bought it because I know she's gonna be teething a lot, and um this would help her just fine with that. <laughs> I bought this from Family Dollar. It's a baby toy, but the ends crinkle and I know that dogs like that sound and right here I know that it will help with with her chewing <laughs> yeah so I got a Nyla bone from Chewy which was four dollars um it's the small dental kit um, Nala Bone, it has, it has peanut, peanut butter flavor, bacon flavor, and it's allergen free. Um, it's just chewing toys because you're, it, when a puppy, when your dog's a puppy, um, she's going to chew a lot. So I decided to get these because if you don't provide you no know, chewing toys, she's going to find her own chewing toys to, to chew and it's going to be your furniture, your shoes anything that she comes in contact with so make sure that you guys get her a lot of toys that she can chew on i also got her small balls because she's gonna be a puppy like i said she's gonna maybe be two pounds when i get her so i got her small balls to play with i also got her this teething ring um on chewy which was just two dollars it's just a teething ring Um, I did get her these co this collar and harness set at Dollar Tree, and it's small, but I'm thinking that it won't fit her because, um, it's a size small, but I'm thinking it won't fit her because she's going to be too small, so I did order another set for her. Um, I did order another set for her, which is coming on Monday, so, um, I don't know, I'm going to keep these because it's going to come in handy. But I did order these sets for her. And I did order this small one from Dollar General. And this is also from Dollar Tree, which was so cute to me. And this is small. But like I said, she's going to be so small, I don't think it's going to fit her. And I also got this texture bone from Dollar Tree. Like I said, it's spikes. So... Basically, she's going to be teething, like I said. Um, I decided to get her this as well. I didn't run into any pet wipes, so I decided to get her these, which I got two of these. Um, it is alcohol and paraben-free. 
It's just traveling wet wipes antibacterial. So it removes um, for hands and face. I do for traveling, moisturizing, thick cloth, fresh scent. So it's for hands and moisturizing towels. So I know, you know, dogs, after she's finished eating, she can have anything in her fur, everything. So I decided to get these pet wipes for her because I thought this would come in handy for her. So I did get two. So it's alcohol and paraben free. I use them. My kids use them. So my dog will use them. Now, on to her things to wear. I did bought her this harness. And I bought her this harness from Amazon for $10. Uh, let me open it out of the package for you guys. Um, I did buy her this plush harness. It's a step in step in harness. Um, take your dog measurement following this diagram. It's from Voyager. You guys can see that. Um, I did decide to get this for her. Uh, but I don't know if she's gonna fit it. So, um, it's a no pull harness. And but um, like I said, I decided to get. Uh, extra extra small which is coming Monday so I did get her harness another harness <laughs> now I decided to being that my house is chilly at night I decided to get her uh, this little vest t-shirt um this is on Amazon for about maybe three bucks it's from a drooling dogs you guys can see that um it says hug me kiss me love me and i thought it was just so cute i mean it's so small and so cute like uh i thought it'd be so cute for her this is just so pretty never seen anything this small for a dog I also purchased her mini. Um, this is another one from from Dog Drooling, which I also purchased this, this, and the one other one, this. For both of these, are like for ten dollars. So I just purchased these, being that my house. It is cold and I don't want her to shiver so I bought these and they're just so cute the last one that I bought which I thought they were so friggin cute oh my god this is my favorite one you guys I will show you guys it says I'm with the human oh my god when I tell you when I seen this I said I have to get it this is just so friggin cute and it's in purple. And I think I bought this for eight bucks on Amazon. It's from the same company, Drooling Dog. And it's just so friggin' cute. Everyone says that my dog is already spoiled, so it is it is what it is at this point. The last thing I bought my dog are bowls, hair bowls for her. I just couldn't help myself. Uh, she's going to be a Yorkie and, you know, the little bowls is just going to be so, so over the top. So friggin' cute. So I decided to get these little bowls for her. Um, I also purchased this at Dollar, G Dollar Tree for a dollar to keep her cleaning supplies and combs and everything that I got that I showed you guys. I bought this from Dollar General, which was five dollars to keep her toys and everything in it now i just received her tag i just just received her tag in the mail i thought it wasn't gonna come before this before this um video but i just received her tag in the mail today and we're gonna open it together to see I just received her tag in the mail. I ordered it. And 
and there it is her name is gonna be karma i wanted to save that at the end of the video so i can show you her tag and it's just my information in the back my numbers and everything in the back but this is her name and it's in a dog bone shape which they also gave me this to hook onto her leash and I'm thinking it's really nice. And I did order this off of Amazon for three bucks. She has another one that I purchased from Walmart. But it's not here with me at the moment. Because I didn't think these were going to come in. And that's it, you guys. I mean, um, like I said, I'm a first-time dog owner. I know I probably went over the top. Um, oh, no. That's not it. I'm sorry. <laughs> her treats i'm so sorry guys her treats my dog will kill me if i was to say that was it without her treats sorry guys so i got overwhelmed with all this stuff and i'm sorry so i did purchase these treats because my dog will be on a um, grain-free, no wheat, no corn, no soy, anything. She's going to be on a grain-free diet. And everything I'm purchasing for her, with, with if it's her treats, her dog food is going to be grain-free. Because that's the best for your dog. And you will want the best for your dog because, hey, you will want the best food for you. So, I mean, um, you will want the best for your dog because I'm not trying to get no... Um, um, going to vet visits because that's pretty expensive so hey why not you know feed your dog healthy and I want the best life for my dog so I decided to feed her healthy so I went with dream bones and it says a new product and I did review because like I said before I buy anything I did look at many dog hauls um puppy hauls puppy sister videos that's why I decided to you know do mine and to help any dog owner that's out there because I'm a first time dog owner so I decided to just post up this video just to help someone because you know a lot of you guys help me because I watch tons and tons of dog videos puppy haul videos so with that being said this is from um dream bones dream naturals but the difference is this is the beef small bites this is beef liver and this is chicken liver and as you can see down here it says no corn wheat gluten or soy no artificial flavors or preservatives and this is good for um training treats made with beef liver liver rich and high ingredient bite-sized treat Idea for snacking, training, and rewarding. So, this is what I purchased for her. Um, I did get this from my grocery store, um, Win Dixie. It's from Evolve. Um, jerky bites. And the the Dream Bones was like three dollars, um, at Walmart. Three dollars each pack from Walmart, and it's a new product. So this is. This is this, and this was like $4. And this is the 12 ounce, and I think this should really fit her, being that I'm going to split it into fours because she's going to be a small pup, like I said. And um, I did um, YouTube that cutting it into fours would be great for your dog. So this is grain-free, the bone salmon, and sweet potato recipe jerky bites. And basically, it has um, real salmon is the number one ingredient, and it's no soy, no corn, no wheat. Um, no artificial flavors and preservatives. So, I decided to go with this for my dog. Next, I decided to go with Chop'em. Chop'em's Chicken Jerky Chips. Home style treat for dogs. It's 95% fat free. And it's perfect for training. Great as training treats made with premium chicken breast. And you can just, like I said, it's small. But you can cut it into fours. If you have a small breed, like myself. And it's just healthy all around for your dog. Um, I decided to get these. It's from Walmart. And it's Bully Sticks. I don't know too much about this. It's the Cadet Small. As you can... It's four pack small. I'm going to try it out. I'm going to try it out. Because it's very thin and small for her. I'm going to like supervise her, of course, with it. 
I don't know. I haven't read any reviews on it, but I decided to get it, being that they said bully sticks is good for your dog when they're teething. And I'm deciding to go with this for my dog. <clears throat> yeah. So that's pretty much it, you guys. Thank you for watching my video. Um, I'm going to do an update when I'm going to go pick her up. Um, and her first night, uh, just, you know, in my house with my kids. So I'm going to try to do like a quick video of her. Her name is Karma. We're just so excited. Me and my kids are super excited to have her. If you guys have any questions, comment below. I'm going to try to edit this video and um, post a couple of pictures at the end of this video. Until next time. If you guys have anything that I'm missing, I know that I'm missing one thing. is the pet scooper. That's what I'm missing for her. Um, anything else, you guys just leave it down below. And have a great evening. Till next time. Bye.